Here we go. Song is coming. As a man, sometimes I feel inadequate. Then you come and you move and you doubt the bit. Yeah, it's got a little. Yes, sir, I can step right out of it. It's a lot of The love of you is true, never counterfeit. All the time, no one knows. And here's the thing we only need it for sinking purposes. Okay? You may, like this song right now. Austin still has things he's going to do to it. Now his vocals aren't going to change, the tempo's not going to change. So he could add strings, he could add, you just want to make sure when you're on the set, whatever you're lip syncing to, the vocals aren't going to change. Okay? Your song does not have to be polished yet, does not have to be mixed, it just has to be enough. That you can hear it, keep the tempo. Okay? So you're, you're going to need something loud enough just to sing along too. So you're saying I could have my demo where like, it could, could it be a demo? Absolutely. But as long as the vocal parts are solid and yep. they're not going to change. Yep. So the structure's not going to change. Yep. Nothing's going to change. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So um, again, because you want to get out there doing as much as you can as quickly as possible. Don't think in the terms of, well, I need to get that song mixed before I can go make a music video. Again, one more thing that becomes an excuse. We do not want that. So you um, need a camera, you need a song, you need some form of playback. And coming back to the first thing, a spot. Okay, we want to be photographers here. So I'm going to start right here, okay? And what I love about this is when I first met Luke, uh, we were at a restaurant, and that restaurant had a wall like this. And Luke came back because he loved the wall, and he just built this himself, okay? Now, how long did this take you to build? About three months. About three months. That's because you're slow, though, right? Yeah. No. Other responsibilities. Yeah, of course. No, but it. Right. But if you wanted to just put wood slats, yeah. How long would that take you? Uh, not that long. Yeah, I mean it's it, it's yeah. simple. You know, I mean, so the the idea is, is you want to find an initial background that you think would be cool for a photo, and then turn that into your first set. Okay. So I came in here. I saw this. Here's what I'm going to do. This is where it gets cool, people. I'm gonna pull one of these out here. And this is what you do, you walk on the set. Remember, don't think in terms of what's over here or what's over here. You're only thinking in terms of, we need a photo right now. We're, we're gonna bring everything in and, we're, and we're, we're, we're just gonna fill the frame. My dad taught me when I was a young kid his, his entire life, up to the point where he passed away, even the week before he passed away, we were still talking about, he always said to me, Darren, just fill the frame. He did special effects, and he was the guy that got to do second unit directing. So special effects is the explosions, the bullet hits, wind, rain, and he always said when you do explosions, never do wide shots. You always have the camera tight so that the explosion fills the frame. If it fills the frame in the movie, it feels huge. And when he said fill the frame, I was like, I mean, it just, it changed, that was another thing that just changed everything for me we're going to fill the frame, you know, like that's all we're going to do. So I'm looking at this, put this right here. I'm going to grab my camera. Where's my camera? I'm in the zone now. Grab my camera. Is there a tripod somewhere? And maybe a tripod, maybe a tripod. Who can help me out? That's why you want to have friends. That's why you want to have friends because. It's cool if I change my shirt. Do it. Yeah, yeah. So cool. Yeah, so we were talking. That's right. So let's get a little something. Uh, yeah, so we're ready to shoot. So uh, Austin, you just get something that you feel real good on. Now look though, cause this is our vibe, right? So we're here. We're looking at this. There we go. There we go. Let's do it. So he's going to go change. I'm going to throw this on tripod here. Oh, this guy. I'll make sure I want to record this so that everyone can see real time. Are we, are we 24 on this? 24 frame? Yes. Yeah. So we are recording. There's Leah right there. This is our this is our cam this is our action cam, the actual camera we are gonna to use to make a music video. Again, nothing fancy yet. 
So I'm going to sit down here. I'm going to fill the frame here. something on the lens here. So Leah, come here. Yep. This is the stuff I love, because then all of a sudden. That already looks amazing. I mean, come on. What the heck? <laughs> right, that's what I mean. Like, <laughs> you sit here and, and you see things like this. The, the yeah. artist needs to start thinking in terms of, I can use that moment. I can use that corner. I can use a that. Some a wall. A wall. This is it. Boom. This will be our first take. I'm going to pull it, get a little separation well, from there. Well the chair. It's done. And I guess, I guess, you know, and some of these box lights you can get for like 40 bucks on Amazon too. So these. cheap. Everything's cheap. Yeah. I mean, sp you know, spend a little money, you know, but I mean, everything is cheap these days. I've done, um, and what I'll do is I'll reference this in the process right now. I did a video for an artist named Matt Nathanson huge singer-songwriter, flew out to Kansas City on a soundstage much like this for a song called Come On Get Higher. It was just a bigger version of this room. I hung a backdrop, we dropped a couple lights, and, and that was it. What kind of backdrop? I, think it just, I just had a, uh, uh, for fun, something that I like to do is I get big, cheap canvases like 10 by 10s or 20 by 20s, gotcha. and I just, put tons of paint on them, smear them, oh. you know, just get dark, weird textures um, and leave them outside for, for weeks. So like crackle and stuff? Crack, it textured, you know, then I just fold it up and then when I need a background, I have like five of those that I just always have standing by. That's awesome. That's you, cheap. And you throw it up, yeah, and you just throw, you just throw up a backdrop. And again, so this, this wood here really just represents anything. You know, you, you could go and get a um, painter's cloth, okay. huge, yeah. cheap at Home Depot, and just hang gray toned, you know, drop cloth. Yeah. Cheap, big, just hang them. Same effect. Hang some lights, go to the Goodwill, pick up a cool, funky chair, you know. And, and you're going, but this is that moment you had, that's the breakthrough moment. Well, wait, wait, I've, you've been in this room this whole time. Now, when I first walked in this room, first time I came here, I was like, that's a set. That's gonna be a set. Cause so look, 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 look at that wall. We're, yeah. we're, 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 we're gonna use this too. I like that background with the, with the cave. Oh yeah, I mean, the, I mean, again, this is, um, what do we call this, Luke? Corrugated metal, what do we call this? Yeah. Yeah, and how much are those sheets? 20 bucks for corrugated metal. Now, Luke's done a great job of putting this all together, but you could just go get a bunch and lean them up against something. And these, these are how many pieces? We got one, two, three, four. So take corrugated metal, put it up against the wall, the same thing we have right here. There's your backdrop, hang some lights. Love it. Right? Okay, so now, are you, are you ready, Austin? Okay, so Austin, sit, well, sit, look, real quick, Austin, as you can see what we did here, boom. Okay. We just, we found our frame. Perfect. Boom, bring that chair up. That's like, how we start. It's like the Starship Enterprise. Yeah. <laughs> it's more of a sci-fi video, you know? There it is. Boom. So now what I'm going to do is, just like taking a picture, like I, I'm going to figure out what feels right. So let's, let's grab your guitar. Luke, if you could, could you see if we can grab and just ma make a mess out of this? And I know it's messy, but music videos are messy. Kind of bring the sound right here as close as we can get to Austin. Okay, so already, Leah, let me show you what's going on here. So I'm, 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 I'm looking at this. It survived. Okay. Now this is where a little bit of art comes into play, because so this is the wide shot, right? Yeah. I've, I've zoomed in to get rid of the sort of, get rid of the environment, but it's a little flat for me right now. So what I want to do is, um, I'm going to have Austin come up. Let's push the whole chair up a little bit, come a little bit closer. There you go. There you go. Nice. I'm going to pull the camera back a little bit here. Leo, watch this.